This is Julia. She was diagnosed with osteoporosis a few years back. Movimia strengthens her bones by stimulating bone formation. Movimia can be easily administered. Julia injects herself every day with her new reusable Movimia pen. The pen can be used for the entire treatment period. We will start by showing you how to use your Movimia pen for the very first time. First, Place everything on a clean surface. The starter kit comes with the Movimia pen, which we will look at in detail, as well as the Movimia cartridge pack. You will also need a new sterile pen needle in its protective cap, disinfectant, any disinfectant will do, and a safety container to dispose used needles. The Movimia cartridge lasts for 28 daily injections. This means you only need to replace the empty cartridge with a new one once every 29 days. We will show you this in more detail later on. It is a good idea to write down the date of the first injection with the new cartridge on the cartridge pack. This helps to know when the 28 daily doses per cartridge have been used up. We will now show you how to insert a new cartridge step by step. To insert a new cartridge, we first remove the cap, then the cartridge holder by turning it. The new Movimia cartridge should be undamaged, clear, and colorless. Next, we insert the cartridge, like this. Then screw the cartridge holder and the housing back together. Now we attach the needle. Push and screw the needle clockwise onto the cartridge holder. When it is in firmly, remove the outer needle cap. Remove and dispose the inner needle cap. If some droplets come out of the needle tip, don't worry, it's normal. After insertion of a new cartridge, we do what is called priming of the cartridge. This is also a functionality test of the pen that is done before the first injection from a new cartridge. Turn the dose knob clockwise by two clicks until the droplet sign is in line with the indicator stripe. Now, hold the pen with the needle pointing upwards. Press the push button fully in with your thumb and hold it pressed. Liquid should emerge from the needle tip. The dose indicator will return to the start position. If no liquid comes out, repeat this process. Occasionally, a needle may be blocked. In this case, replace the needle and repeat the priming. After priming, you can use the same needle to inject the dose. We will show you how to inject the dose in more detail later. We will now show you everything you need to know for your daily injections step by step. This pen has a cartridge inside and has already been primed. Place everything on a clean surface. To start, we need to attach the needle. We do this in the same way as when setting up the pen for the first time. Make sure the needle pack is undamaged. For every injection, we use a new needle to prevent infection. We open the needle pack right before the injection. Push and screw the needle clockwise onto the cartridge holder. Now it sits firmly and you can remove the outer needle cap. Remove and dispose the inner needle cap. If some droplets come out of the needle tip, don't worry, it's normal. To set the dose, turn the dose knob clockwise until it stops, and you see the arrow sign aligned with the indicator stripe. 
you will feel some resistance at this point. Don't force the dose knob any further. The good news is you cannot overdose yourself. You can inject your dose either on the upper thighs or on the lower abdomen. Disinfect the skin. Then hold the pen at a 90 degree angle and insert the needle straight and gently into the skin. Press the injection button down slowly and firmly. The dose indicator will return to the start position. Keep the needle in the skin fold for a further six seconds. Pull the pen out slowly. Check the display window to make sure it has returned to the start position. The full dose has been injected. You have done it. To avoid injury, pick up the outer needle protective cap and carefully push it onto the pen needle. Screw the needle cap anti-clockwise to remove the pen needle. Dispose of it in a needle disposal container to avoid injuries to yourself or anyone around you. You will know when the cartridge is empty because if there is not enough medicine left, you will not be able to turn the dose knob to the full dose. This is when you know it's time to change the cartridge. We will now show you how to do this step by step. To insert a new cartridge, we remove the cap, then the cartridge holder by turning it. Then remove the empty cartridge. We insert the new cartridge like this. Push the threaded rod back into the housing until it stops, like this. This rod empties the cartridge over a period of 28 days, dose by dose. Then, screw the cartridge holder and the housing back together. Now, we attach the needle. Push and screw the needle clockwise onto the cartridge holder. When it is in firmly, remove the outer needle cap. Remove and dispose the inner needle cap. After insertion of the new cartridge, we do what is called priming of the cartridge. This is also a functionality test of the pen that is done before the first injection from a new cartridge. Turn the dose knob clockwise by two clicks until the droplet sign is in line with the indicator stripe. Now, hold the pen with the needle pointing upwards. Press the push button fully in with your thumb and hold it pressed. Liquid should emerge from the needle tip. The dose indicator will return to the start position. If no liquid comes out, repeat this process. After priming, you can use the same needle to inject the dose. After each injection and before we store the pen, we remove the needle. For every injection, we use a new sterile needle. To avoid injury, pick up the outer needle protective cap and carefully push it on the pen needle. Screw the needle cap anti-clockwise to remove the pen needle. Dispose of it in a needle disposal container to avoid injuries to yourself or anyone around you. Reattach the pen cap after each use. And then put the Movimia pen with the cartridge back into the refrigerator immediately until the next injection at the same time tomorrow. If you need to transport your Movimia pen with a cartridge inside, it is important that you keep it at a temperature between 2 degrees Celsius to 8 degrees Celsius, for example by using a cooling bag. You may come back to these instructions any time when you change the cartridge again. If you don't want to do the injection yourself, a carer or a relative can do it for you.